Hi everyone, welcome to Evie's Toy House and today we're going to make more My Little Pony paper crafts. So I recently got this book and just take a look inside our cutouts for 19 ponies. So here is the character lineup. As you can see, these are some of the most favorite characters in the series. So in my first video, I made Twilight Sparkle and here she is. Many of you guys enjoyed that video and wanted to see more, specifically some of the princesses. So we have three princesses here, Princess Celestia, Princess Luna, and Princess Cadence. And many of you requested Princess Celestia. So that's what we're going to do today. We are going to make Princess Celestia. And she is over here. As you can see, all her pieces here. And this time, instead of using tape, I'm going to attempt to use some um, fast grab tacky glue. So I got a pack of this. There's three types in here. There's the fast grab, there's quick dry, and there's clear gel. So hopefully one of these will work. All right, let's get started. So the first thing we're gonna do is punch out our pony. There's just so many pieces. So let's go ahead and do one page at a time. The perforations are really good in this book. You can, um, you don't have to use an exacto knife, but you should be careful just because the paper isn't super thick. It's thick paper, but it's not cardboard. So you do want to be a little bit careful when you punch it out. But I wouldn't think you need to use exacto knife. I haven't made a tear yet um, while punching it out by hand. And here we're just going to make the creases. Okay. So starting with the face, I am going to use the fast grab. And hopefully it will grab it really fast. A little bit tricky because there is a bend right there. Oh, I think it's working. Okay, so this is actually working pretty good. All right, and here is the head. And as you can see, it's already starting to look pretty good. So the tacky glue method worked really well. The only part that I couldn't get was down here. I just couldn't push it closer, but I think it's okay since you won't be looking at the bottom anyways. So let's build the rest of the pony. Here's the front and back right leg. So this is actually doing really good too. And here is the body. So I think the body is actually the most difficult piece to build just because we have a few curves here and the top and bottom pieces don't always fit perfectly. So I did use a little bit of tape here just to hold it together, but otherwise it just kept popping apart. But otherwise I think it's gonna hold pretty well and the glue is doing a really good job. So still very happy with the glue. Once we have all the pieces, we're going to put it all together. All right, and we are done. So here is Princess Celestia <laughs> in 3D paper form. And she looks a lot better than, um, than Twilight did because this time I used very little tape. 
I still needed to use some tape for the legs to hold it up and um, also back here at the back of the neck here. Other than that, I actually used the tacky glue for the rest of it and she looks so much better. And this was a very complicated one. As you can see, the tail here has quite a bit of curve here and also the mane. The mane here is also curved and the mane here in the front is also curved. So this was a very interesting build. But she looks fantastic. What do you think? I love her wings and I love that she is bigger than Twilight Sparkle here. So here's Twilight Sparkle. You can see that her wing is smaller. Um, Celestia's wings is much bigger and also her legs are longer. As for the face, it's about the same size but of course she has her Celestia eyes and her mane is just much more big and pronounced than Twilight Sparkle's. I do want to thank everyone who commented in the previous video. Some of your advice on what type of glue to use was very helpful. So do you want to see another pony? If you do, comment below and let me know. Alright, I'll see you next time. Bye!